Thank you, Leader McCarthy. I appreciate it. Uh, this briefing we had today is just confirming the nightmare that we already know is coming and that's already here. Uh, Any time in this country you hear of a drug overdose death, whether it be in Topeka, Kansas or Syracuse, New York, my hometown, you have to understand that every single community is a border community in this country and every single state's a border state because the poison that's coming across our borders that's much more easy to do because of the influx of uh, immigrants or uh, illegal aliens coming across is making it impossible to stop. And it's killing our, killing our kids all over the country. Some of the quick stats for you. Right now they're seeing about 8,000 members, or 8,000 aliens a day coming across. 8,000. Operational control is about 5,000. They expect once Title 42 is, is, is rescinded, it'll go up to as much as 18,000 a day. There's no way that we can control the border in any way, shape, or form if that happens. Now, I want you to do some math here, because all my colleagues will talk about some of the other things, but do the simple math. You cannot cross the border unless you pay the cartels a minimum of $4,000. So if you have 8,000 a day coming across times $4,000, that's $32 million a day, which is a billion dollars a month going to cartels. So what are they doing with this money? They're investing in being able to make fentanyl themselves and not have it imported from China. They're, in, they're, they're investing in cyber criminal activity. They're creating basically states, nation states within Mexico uh, that are criminal organizations that are further gonna destabilize Mexico. And for the first time in our nation's history, we have a very good chance because of what's going on this, with, with this president's policies of having a destabilized nation on our border. So it's far more than just the aliens coming across. It's far more than just the drugs coming across. This is a national security issue that's going to be uh, that's going to further get worse as this, as this uh, time goes on this summer. It's going to get much worse when they rescind Title 42, and it's a damn shame because our country can't can't handle it. And uh, next, I want you to uh, hear from Yvette Harrell.